Where to start? Um, eu vou ler essas palavras para você. Então você pode praticar um, seu ouvindo, né? Ok, vamos lá. We'll start at the beginning, of course. I'd like to share with you where this passion for learning other languages and helping others to learn English began years ago. When I was in first grade, a beautiful young blonde woman, Miss Henning, came to my school to further her education toward being a teacher. She did this by helping with the first grade class in which I was learning. So many things were being taught. We learned about math and English and geography and so much more. But the thing that stood out in my mind and heart that year was that this beautiful young woman taught us French. She took the minds and hearts of those 20 plus kids and taught us to count from one to 10 in French. It was mysterious and beautiful and it caught me in its web. I, I was hooked to this day I consider Miss Henning a major reason I love foreign language. A few short years later, I studied Latin in junior high, and I loved it. It began to help unravel the mystery that is English. It taught me some of the whys and hows of my language. A tiny woman named Fairy Helen Hunt taught a class of teenagers about this ancient language that is to this day still alive and active and useful. Though barely five feet tall with her excitement and her passion about this language, she would shout and wave her arms to get and keep the attention of this class of teenagers. To this day, I consider Mrs. Hunt a major reason I love foreign language. The following year, I studied Spanish and the beauty of this language drew me in as I heard the Latin American music in our voices as we tried to sing, speak these beautiful new words. That same year, while on a canoeing trip in a nearby river, I met a young man who was paddling a canoe near me, singing loudly in Spanish. I was thrilled to understand a word here and there and to be able to communicate with him somewhat. I later learned that Carlos was from Cali, Colombia, and he was an exchange student in a town hours from here. My friend Carlos and I traded letters for the following three years, trying, failing, and trying again to write in one another's languages. <laughs> what a good time it was! To this day, I consider Carlos a major reason I love foreign language. I look back at those days and I look at days um, in the not too distant past as well. My husband and I met in junior high school, married in our late twenties, and went on to have four children, four children. Through my sister, we heard of the opportunity to host foreign exchange students, and we have shared our home with kids from Sweden, Brazil, South Korea, Thailand, and Vietnam so far. While hosting our son from Brazil in 2008, my heart was completely taken in by this young man as he taught about his culture, his country, his people, and his language. Since then, my desire has been to learn about Brazil and Brazilian Portuguese and to help my friends there perfect their English, if that's what they want. 
what an opportunity we have. Will you join me in this adventure? You have become one of my major reasons for loving foreign language. Abraços e beijos para você. Have a great day, and God bless you. Tchau, tchau.